Metronet and the City of Fayetteville have announced a partnership to build a 100% fiber optic network providing internet, television, and phone services to businesses and residents in the Fayetteville region. Cumberland County will be Metronet's first deployment in North Carolina. Metronet will invest more than $70 million on the project, which will serve as Fayetteville and surrounding areas, as well as portions of Hope County. The community's need for increased broadband access has become more apparent amid COVID-19, with students virtual learning and employees working remotely. Metronet's high-speed fiber will provide fast and reliable internet service that will address this need. Construction on this project is expected to begin within the next few weeks and will take about two and a half years to complete. The economic impact created by this project will be huge as it will create an infrastructure that will give Fayetteville and Cumberland County a competitive edge when seeking new businesses and will create jobs in our community. Approximately 200 jobs will be created from just the construction phase alone. Additionally, for long-term employment, Metronet plans to hire local market management positions, sales and customer service professionals, and service technicians to support the Fayetteville area. To learn more about the construction progress, visit construction.metronetinc.com. A new temporary art piece has been installed downtown. The Cool Spring Downtown District worked in collaboration with the Arts Council of Fayetteville, Cumberland County to install the Unity Bell. Artist John Shoneman designed the eight-foot-tall piece, which is constructed out of approximately 10 different recycled and reclaimed materials. It's an interactive piece with a rubber mallet attached for people to strike the bell, which serves as a gong. People can experience the gong not just visually, but orally, too. It's located on the corner of Hay Street and Green Street. The Cool Spring Downtown District invites you to come downtown to experience the Unity Bell while it is temporarily on display. Fayetteville will soon be getting two new dog parks for our four-legged friends to enjoy. The dog parks will be located in West Fayetteville on undeveloped city-owned properties, and each park will span about three and a half acres. The future sites are located at Westover Park off Bonanza Drive and Fayetteville Fire Station No. 17, located off Bailey Lake Road. Currently, the only city-owned dog park in Fayetteville is located on Northeastern Boulevard. This park design will serve as an inspiration for the new parks. Each dog park will include separate play areas for large and small dogs. A gravel parking lot will be located outside each play area. The construction process is expected to begin in February and could be completed by mid-June. City leaders have budgeted about $98,000 for each dog park. Money from the city's Green Space Fund and General Fund will be used to cover cost of the new dog parks. The next step in the process is to clear each site. The City Council identified building more dog parks across the city as one of their targets for action for the 2021 fiscal year. For updates on the dog parks, visit the Fayetteville Cumberland Parks and Recreation Facebook page. Fayetteville Regional Airport is excited to announce a new destination coming soon. Beginning in March, American Airlines will begin offering daily service from Fayetteville Regional Airport to Dallas-Fort Worth International Airport. The new service will complement current year-round American Airlines service to Charlotte Douglas International. Flights will be operated with a CRJ-900 regional jet equipped with nine first-class seats and 67 main cabin seats. With the addition of Dallas-Fort Worth service to its roster, Fayetteville Regional Airport will now offer more than 300 one-stop destinations, giving you more reasons to fly Fay. In addition to the new destination, Fayetteville Regional Airport is currently under construction for terminal renovations Phase 2. In January 2020, the airport opened a new Concourse A, featuring two new jet bridges, a new rotunda, and restaurant area. Phase 2 will feature a brand new facade to the old terminal building, updated baggage and ticket areas, a new TSA checkpoint, and administrative offices. Project planners estimate Phase 2 construction to be completed by December 2021. According to a recent report from the North Carolina Department of Transportation's Division of Aviation, Fayetteville Regional Airport has a $790 million economic impact in our community, supports more than 4,500 jobs, and contributes $28 million to state and local taxes.